What's good, party people? It's your boy, Fat Dollars, bringing you some more Madden 17 Ultimate Team. And we're going to have gameplay in this video. We also going to have an updated roster. Let y'all see the Savage Squad debut and how the new chemistries is going to work, man. Make sure you hit that like button if you ain't did it already. What is you waiting on? Let's go. You can see the squad, baby. We went and picked up award winner, 88 overall, Tyrod Taylor. We got Lockett in the number two position. That's only because of the playbook that I use. He usually do the double moves, and then if he's one-on-one -on -one with that speed, it's over. We got Derrick Henry leading the way as the halfback number one. We got Reggie Bush for the third down back and the receiving back out of the backfield. Marvin Harrison, number three. Herman Moore, number one. We also got that boy Fuller. 81 overall gold is a straight beast. You feel me? Still got Jerry Cook at the top, leading the tight end position. And then we got Delaney Walker as the number two. We also got so many chemistries. We got about five or six chemistries activated. And on the defensive side, we made some changes. 90 overall, strong safety, winning picked up Bruce Irvin. He got bumped up to an 86 overall, winning, uh, got three user linebackers, as you can see right here. Got rid of Von Miller, you know. People was pancaking him, so I just went with base ends and then boosted them up. Still got Josh Norman. I need to upgrade one more cornerback because Josh Norman's speed, I would rather have him in the slot position so he don't have to uh, guard all the way down the field, but... He make it do what it do right now. We got that flashback Farley, and then we got Sue, you know, the original Detroit Lions unification. Let's jump into this game. My opponent got the ball right here. Three minutes left in the first quarter. I'm just going to show y'all the basic setup and the highlights of the game as he comes out in the counter. I wasn't expecting it, but you can see Jadavian Clowney out there with the block shed. And that guy that he was using right there, I think is a fullback. He was a straight savage, man. That guy takes about two to four people to take him down. I don't even know what overall he was, but the boy was out there doing his thing. But this game is all about Tyrod Taylor and seeing what the new defensive chemistry is all about. He puts a guy in motion right here. It's not a counter play, but I jumped the rope with Wilson. And we gonna take that back to the house for a pick six, baby. Ain't no refunds over here. I am back on defense again, and we are dropping everybody back in coverage, and that boy Mario Williams comes down with the sack. That's that boosted chemistry, flashback Mario Williams. He wasn't really too bad of a beast before, but with that boosted chemistry, and the way that I got Jadavian Clowney over there lurking on the outside, he gets put in a lot of one-on-one -on -one situations. As you can see, it looks like he has a guy open, but we end up getting a finger on the ball and breaking it up. Good defensive stand, and right here, fourth and ten, my opponent is going for it. And Josh Norman undercuts it instead of playing over the top like he was supposed to. And Hopkins runs in for the touchdown. Now it's time to get my offense on the field and go through this three-play money scheme that I got. I'm going to let y'all see it right here as we dump it off short right here to Harrison. And we just going to pick up our yards and run out of bounds. Got to play smart. Can't let a big hit change the team. You can see the uniforms that I'm rocking right here. That's from winning 10 games. And this guy is user in the safety, so we doing all our audibles, and we just going to throw it to Jerry Cook over the top if he can get some separation. I see him right there, and we going to wreck catch that in for the touchdown. But there's a lot more of that coming as he comes out with the counter again. And like I said, this is that fullback beast right here, and it takes about 555 people to take him down. I don't even know how to pronounce his name, but the boy is a sack. So we're going to have to lock that down. You know, his stamina can't be too good. And like I told y'all in the tips video, if they come out in this close type formation under the center, it's going to be a lot of counters and stretches. If it's a pass play, we'll be able to lock that down over the top. 
but we just watching off for the runs. He runs it again, runs over one guy, runs over two guys, breaks three tackles, breaks four tackles, and we finally take him down. Third and seven. This is a big third and seven. We can't let the corner routes get us open. We got, and he comes down with the same exact tight route again on fourth and inches we knock it down he was looking for the stick type formation that ain't happening in our house you might as well run it up the middle that's the best chance that you got right here so i can see he's being a return and using that safety again i don't know what he's doing he must don't know about the speed so we're gonna put him in motion he's gonna try to cover the flats we got everybody open in case and i see jerry cook again tyrod taylor with the good presence in the pocket and we find Jared Cook for the second time, the Tyrod Taylor, Jared Cook connection. Second and 10, this game is getting out of hand. It's 21 to seven. We need a stop right here. He's going for the screen. We are gobbling that up. That is not gonna work on us, folks. That is not gonna work on us. Cue the music, this is a bit. Third and 13. We need a stop right here. No more of them fluke over the top two possession. We're going to get a big hit right here. Wilson coming in, laying the lumber, and it was a turnover. Went for it on fourth down and didn't get it. Right here, he expecting for me to streak, and we just going to hit him with a quick route. Bad user right there. Jerry Cook for the third time. Tyrod Taylor, Jerry Cook, Savage Squad debut. Let's go. The coach is going crazy, man. If you enjoyed the gameplay, make sure you hit that thumbs up button right below. And I'll bring you more gameplay. We should have one more video today. I'm not going to tell y'all what it is, but you should already know if you've been staying tuned on the video. Let's go.